do too. What's going on? It's your boy Shotty23 bringing y'all another sneaker pickup of mine. Uh, post out, uh, Postman just dropped these off today, so I'm pretty excited about these. Um, as you can tell, two things. First off, there's no marking on the boxes. Uh, got these a, couple, a little early. Secondly, well, you can't really tell, but uh, this wasn't double box, which I hate. Uh, I know a lot of people out there, when you get your boxes, you want that double box. But that's how it came all messed up. But I guess it's the shoes that really count, right? Let's get started here. Starting first, we got, you know what I'm saying? Oh, we got the True Blue 3, size 12. Come out in August. You know? These came with the, uh, still with the box tag at least. Uh, okay, it's the True Blue Threes. Other than the uh, other than the uh, the Mocha Threes, these are the only retros that I haven't owned in the Threes. And no, these aren't the 01 retros. These are the 09 retros that are set to come out again, like I said in August. I was saying, got the y'all can see the Jumpman logo in there. Got the elephant print. The elephant print up there too. Sad. Blue really isn't my color. I say that while I'm wearing the shirt, but blue really isn't my color. I like these though. I wish I would have got these earlier, a little festive for the 4th of July weekend. But, well, that's that. And then these. I got real early. Got the Rising Sun 12s. These are set to come out in October, I believe. Pretty hyped about these. Got the patent leather. You know, all white. That's another one. That's another thing that's kind of. A lot of people don't really do. Easy to get dirty. I like these. I like the patent leather with the little reptile print looking on there. Remind me of my Kobe 4s. And I like the perforated leather. That's also pretty dope. I'm, I'm kind of hyped to wear these a little early. I don't know too many people who got these just yet. And of course, like always, all my kicks are official, 100% authentic. I don't get down with no fakes. B grades, nothing like that. Do a little quick comparison with my uh, with my new buck 12s. That was sad. Other than, of course, the materials that are used. And then on the uh, thing about these the rising suns is cool. I don't know if y'all see that on the on the eyelid there's got the little shiny plastic, but it's got the little plastic covers on each side you just tear off. So that's all right. That's pretty cool. I wish it was a little bit more uh, metal. Another thing I'm not too happy about, of course, you always got that on one shoe. It's kind of messed up. Good thing the other one's not that bad. I definitely might rock these like really soon. But uh, there you have it, folks. Again, we got the, uh, the Rising Sun 12s set to come out in uh, October. And then we have your uh, True Blue Threes coming out this August. I know a few people have these already. Uh, I still, from what I'm still hearing, these are still international release. So if you can get your hands on them ahead of time. You know, definitely get, make sure to get them. Um, I don't know if Jordan Brand changed their minds just yet, but I, I bought these just to make sure because I am not one for surprises. And if I have the opportunity to get them early, I'm going to do it. But other than that, that's it. Uh, thanks for peeping my video. Check out for what I got coming up next.
Um, happy collecting and be easy. Peace.